Good afternoon. I'm State Representative Rudy Hobbs. I uh, want to first thank uh, the Labor's leadership, uh, Mike Aaron, uh, Jonathan Berg here, for keeping this issue at the forefront. I uh, also want to thank uh, Representative Lane uh, for her leadership on this. She has been a tremendous champion of uh, a road funding and making sure that we have safe roads here in the state of Michigan. Uh, and I've been very happy to partner with her as a state representative in that. Uh, we have been going around this state talking to everyone about how important it is to make sure that we fix our roads. When, when we have situations where one in eight of our bridges are in poor condition, uh, we're putting the public at risk. And for us to leave Lansing uh, without having a solution to road fundings was absolutely unacceptable. Uh, we have been talking about road funding for at least several months now. And we need to get serious as a legislature to make sure that we're finding the solutions uh, to put the $1.4 billion into our roads, the, the investment that's needed to not only put people back to work, but just to have safe roads. People on average here in the state of Michigan are already being taxed uh, to fix our roads. They're, they're paying for the $357 average repair that goes along with their cars. My daughter, I just replaced a sway bar because she hit a pothole. I have a broken rim. You know, that was $300 for the sway bar. That's another $180 for the rim. I'm already paying for our roads. It's time for us to get serious, find the solutions. Uh, I have been sitting at the table uh, since day one ready to support a package uh, that will include the necessary investment so that we can put people back to work, so that we can have people invest in our, in our region, in our city, uh, but more importantly, to make sure that we have safe roads because that, at the end of the day, that's what's important. None of us want to see that happen. If that was to happen on our watch, we will all be embarrassed, and it's an absolutely unacceptable situation. So I stand here with the laborers, and very proud to stand here with the laborers and my colleagues saying we need to get back to work, we need to find a solution, let's put people back to work, let's have safe roads, because that's what we're about as a responsible legislature. Thank you.